Hey guys, welcome back to a, another video. Um, I know I said uh, I was going to do weekly videos, or at least try, um, but life got in the way, and I missed a couple weeks or a few weeks, but uh, today I want to do a, another, um, another toy review, so I will show you what, in a second and what it is. Alright, so I got it, and please, it's a uh, DC Multiverse Clayface. I'm going to turn on the light real fast. There we go. A little bit better, but you'll see it better outside of the package in a moment. But yeah, this is one of their Mega Figs. There we go. A little bit better. Open it up here. is always so loud. Alright, there he is outside of the box. Um, so first thing, he is hollow. Other than his joints and his uh, arms. His arms are pretty solid. Um, but yeah, his articulation is kind of easy on the arms. A little stiff around. He can barely move his uh, elbows and stuff. Kind of like this. He can barely move them. Gonna move his hands. You have to push really hard at the risk of it breaking. But other than that, he can wide open, both sides here, both sides there, close, he can swing his arm around, like so. And then his legs can bend, but they're like super hard to bend. So yeah, I think the reason why he is so stiff and not so versatile in the articulation is because he is so big. Um, and the reason why he's hollow is because he's so big. Uh, just imagine if this thing was solid plastic. I mean, it's already pretty hefty as it is. It weighs roughly like 2, 3, 4, maybe 5 pounds at max. Um, but if you look closely, you can see the details on him. You see all the faces and the hands. I think they did a really good job with attention to detail of said clay for Clayface, because that's his thing, and it's Clayface, and uh, he just, his body is made of clay, and whatever gets sucked into his body is part of his body, because it's submerged in clay. Um, he stands pretty well. He stands on my hand. And, uh, that's him standing on the table, you can see. Oh, yeah. Yeah. A lot of people, um, complain about him because he looks like poop. But if you think about it, he's clay. And clay is brown, usually. Um, clay is also gray and multicolors, but, uh, he's dirty clay, so he's brown. Um, yeah. So, that'll wrap it up for Clayface, for now. Um, a couple end, uh, notes. Um, this part on his belly is rubber. So... I think that's what makes him kind of move however slightly he can move there. Um, but yeah. So if you want to make him better, in your opinion, you can always customize him. Like paint him or like sculpt new things around him or something like that. Um, I don't necessarily know how to customize figures or what paints necessarily to use or what to use for whatever. 
But uh, I highly recommend if he looks too much like Pooh um, that you customize him and make him look better. Because to be honest, he is a good figure. Um, I really like him. Uh, that is why I opened him and showed you guys. But uh, yeah, other than that, that's it. Thanks for watching. If you uh, enjoyed this video, make sure you subscribe, hit the thumbs up, put my bell notifications on, and I will see you guys in the next video. So now I am going to show you guys what I do after I open figures for my toy reviews. So I cut off the wires and I cut off the um, twist ties and stuff like that and try and leave this part of the box in the best condition as I can. Now, since I will be repackaging and redoing things, I do not take out the stand or the card unless I am going to absolutely play with it or um, not keep the box. So, yeah. All right, that's repackaging. So, I usually, after I get done messing around, is that I put them in a neutral stance. And then I kind of just slide them feet first into the back, so like this, feet first into the back. And I push the back, which is the heaviest part, so it doesn't damage the, the package as much. And I push the arms, I push the arms, the middle of the waist, the legs, and then I kind of straighten them out. Now the only thing is, is that he is so heavy that sometimes the flimsy plastic does break. But so far, um, the packaging seems to hold up pretty well. And that's how he came in uh, before I opened him. And then, after that, put him in the box. Put him in backwards. <laughs> Okay, right side leg. And close these flaps on the side. Kind of basically looks just like how he were to be in the package after or before I open them. Just without the strings in the middle. Those are not visible. But yeah, that's Clayface. So again. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, it's quite hot in my apartment, so I'm sweating. But uh, um, I hope to see you guys next video. Um, subscribe, hit that thumbs up button, hit the bell notifications, and I will see you guys next time. Yeah.